Or do you believe it? I can't believe I just said that. Hey guys, welcome back to Seltzer with KG. I am KG or Katie G, and this week we're doing a special episode. This week, in celebration of 420, we're going to be drinking seltzers, but they're technically non alcoholic. We're doing a myriad of different seltzers this week. We're gonna do some CBD seltzers, THC seltzers, and psychedelic water. So, we're doing six different flavors from three different brands. I'm really excited. If you're new here, this is not a normal episode. If you're looking for the normal gist of things, go look at any of my other videos, how it normally works is I give myself 10 minutes to finish one pan of flavor for a variety pack and then move on to the next flavor with about a five minute break in between to cleanse my palate. This week is going to work a little bit differently. This week I'm going to give myself 10 minutes per can, not to finish it, just to enjoy it for 10 minutes, see what it feels like, take about five to 10 minute break, and then move on to the next one. This could get pretty spicy. I'm going to do CBD first, then THC, and then the psychedelic waters. Before we get started, I want to give you guys my small business of the week. This is Simply Sweet Boutique. Go ahead and check them out on their Instagram right up here. I literally bought this sweatshirt with this episode in mind. It says Toasty and Tipsy, so I knew it was perfect. Let me just run through the brands and the flavors that we have, then we'll get started. The CBD seltzers that we're gonna be doing today are by Mars Community Brewing Company. They're botanical CBD seltzers. We have Juniper Fizz and Flower Power. These are each 30 milligrams of CBD per can, and then we're going to be moving on to a THC seltzer, which is by Tonic, and that is is 25 milligrams of THC. This is black cherry. Also by Tonic, this is technically a beverage, so it's not a seltzer, it is just a THC beverage. Mango pineapple returner, two of my favorite flavors as returners, followers, fans, subscribers, you guys know these are two of my favorite flavors. The whole thing is 100 milligrams. They give you a little dosing on the side. I'll know actually how much I drank from this. We're gonna cap it off with psychedelic water. The two flavors that I have are hibiscus lime and blackberry yuzu flavor. If you don't already, follow me on Instagram, subscribe on YouTube, like and follow me on Facebook, but especially follow me on Instagram. I post all my updates there. I'm actually doing a highlight tonight of an update after each drink. We're gonna get this started. Wish me luck, I already bought bunchies. Happy Stony 420 day, love you All right, y'all, so we're kicking it off with a CBD elixir botanical seltzer called Juniper Fizz. There is 30 megs of CBD in here. CBD normally doesn't affect me too much, but I'm sure when this all compounds. Right off the bat, it has a very, very floral, very floral smell to it. I don't like that. Ugh. It tastes like gin, but without the alcohol. What is happening? Uh, it has a little lingering. Oh. Oh. oh my god. I enjoy gin cocktails, but this tastes... Oh no. I don't love that. I do feel a little bit relaxed. I do feel good. I'm very zen. It's amazing I don't have as much to talk about when I'm not drunk. All right, I give this a, in terms of taste, a nope. It, it tastes like gin without the alcohol, which to me is not worth it. You can, not a great taste, give it a nope. Okay, we are back with our next CBD drink. This is CBD Elixir Botanical Seltzer Flower Power. I honestly, every time I look at this, I think it's a bud, but it is just a bunch of flowers. It's better than the first one. Huh. It's not like really anything I've ever tasted before. It is florally. Obviously, it's flower power. I am very chill. <laughs> it honestly tastes like somebody crushed up weeds from their backyard and put it in a blender and said, drink this. I would just say I'm two minutes in silence. <laughs> flower power back. All right, back with number three. We have Tonic Fizz Black Cherry Seltzer. This is THC. It is 25 megs of THC. I'm gonna die. That tastes like a popsicle. <gasps> That's yummy. That tastes like a cherry popsicle. You really don't taste the cannabis. Ooh, yum, 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 yum. Oh, that's good. Oh, no. This I got from Maribus Cannabis. Just open in Westchester. Shout out. They're so nice. It's so clean. They're so helpful. Hey, young bee. Where did I even believe it? I can't believe it. I'm just, like, I'm just like in the zone. <laughs> All right, 
tonic black cherry seltzer. Give it a huge ass. It is so delicious. I got about halfway through, so wish me luck with the rest of these. All right, we're back with our next tonic tea tea drink. This is tonic mango pineapple. This one is 100 milligrams. There is a doser on the side, so you can see how much you drink. I love these flavors. I'm hopeful, and I also love that it's resealable. Technically, this is a beverage and not a seltzer. It's good, but you can taste the cannabis a little bit more in this one. Oh boy, I'm like nervous. Already, I'm kind of starting to get the munchies. It is a good mango pineapple taste. It more so tastes like a soapy. You guys remember soapies? It drinks a little too easily in the sense that I can see people downing this on accident. I'm just so like vibing. It does have an aftertaste so I can taste the cannabis in my mouth as I sit here. Hey ma, 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 mom. Hello there, loopsie. Wow, loopsie. Mom, 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 mom. You don't want this. I'll give you catnip later. I now understand why it's called a strobe. It's funny because I have a lot of thoughts in my head. I'm just like not saying them out loud. Oh, boss track time. <laughs> So this is tonic mango pineapple <laughs> THC. I give it a huge yes. Woo All right, we are moving on to the next flavor. I just need a half a bag of popcorn. Woo. We have psychedelic water. This flavor is hibiscus slime. Oh, that's a lot. It's florally, but flor, 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 florally. It's florally. Is that a word? Florally. Floral. The florally. Florally. <laughs> florally. Florally. Is that what? <laughs> it's florally. It's very floral. <laughs> Very floral. And there is a fruitiness. It is all hitting me. <laughs> it's oh man. You can get these online at their website at psychedelicwater.com. I wish they would have gone with another fruit pairing with hibiscus over lime, like apple hibiscus. Ooh, that would be so Not mean. <sighs> this is a lot. <laughs> I know there's no alcohol in there, but that tastes really strong. Can you see my eyes? Oh, they're little. <laughs> oh. <sighs> I keep thinking if I raise my eyebrows higher and make my eyes bigger, but that's as far as I go. Ooh, buddy. <laughs> Holy banana sans. <laughs> banana pants. <laughs> Okay, psychedelic water, hibiscus, and lime. I give it a yes, it is tasty. Last but not least, we have the other psychedelic water, blackberry and yuzu. Ooh. I don't like that. Juniper one, you know, you probably don't know. <laughs> it wasn't even funny. Okay, Katie, compose yourself here. You're not high. You're not high. <laughs> it kind of tastes like a peanut butter and jelly. Oh boy. I thought I was going to be like cooking up all these like THC and jokes. I'm just chilling. Okay, like it all the water, blackberry, and yuzu flavor. Yes! Thank you for coming to my 420 episode. I'm gonna go eat my weight and food. This was fun. I would recommend both of the tonics. I would not super recommend the rest of it. Psychedelic waters are good, but I, basically everything but the CBD stuff. What was I saying? <laughs> okay, bye! <laughs> <laughs> You're a slurp chart when you clean your butthole.